Aries, there's definitely a detour that has taken place here. Um, when it comes down to this marriage, higher connection, baby mom, baby dad. Listen, somebody here does not want this cycle to end, okay? This cycle to change. They don't want this, this closing of the cycle at all, okay? They're very closed off. They're guarded. They're resistant to it, okay? You guys, they're fighting it. Um, even though they done did the absolute most. And we already know that. There's toxicity, bondage patterns. There's shocking news that somebody has gotten here. Possibly could be a pregnancy or some type of control tactics um, that are be uh, sexual control tactics that are being used by a third party, possibly for some of you guys. Also, we got a workplace affair. Now, I do got trapped to the side, you guys. So those that you was laced up, you know what I'm saying? You guys go to job with the suit and, you know, y'all business outfit on. This right here won't apply to you. This right here is a street situation, okay? So with this here trap and with this workplace fair, for those of you that it resonates that somebody out here in these streets like this, somebody is out here who they either are collabing with, with as far as illegal activity that they're having sex with, or they're selling drugs or whatever the case to somebody who they're selling, they're, um, you know, um, having sex with somebody in that type of situation. Okay. Um, I do have projects, the number Brown and the number red and the cut, the, the letter, excuse me, the number y'all, the color Brown, the color red and the color blue is significant to that situation. Okay. So for those of you who don't have that type of situation going on, there is a workplace fair. Okay. With either a baby mom, baby dad, um, higher connection, um, possibly, um, marriage here okay um this person listen for whatever reason you guys as toxic as they're coming up because they're talk coming up as a whole lot of things okay they're coming up as sex addicted drug addicted for some of you guys they're coming across you know um shadow side negative toxic low vibrational energy okay um for some of you guys some of you guys you're experiencing them being very mean and very nasty okay um but for some reason as i was meditating over this energy and it's obvious that somebody has somebody else here. They're still holding on to this connection. Okay. We're going to find out. Cause I'm like, okay, you doing all this, but at the same time you, okay, no. All right. Yes. There is somebody, there's gossip surrounding this. Okay. If it got something to do with the street situation and somebody out here messing around with somebody out here in these streets that they you're dealing with, you know, in an illegal type of activity, there's definitely gossip going on around this. Okay. There is people that are watching. There's people that knows. Um, this is not secretive. It may have started off as secretive, but there's a lot of curious minds that want to know. Bottom line is the streets talking, okay, about this situation, all right? Now, for others of you, it's the same thing. It's just in a different case scenario, okay? There is gossip around the situation. Somebody is watching. They're spying. They're inspecting, okay? Um, there is um, rebelliousness with somebody is watching and somebody being very rebellious, okay? Um, and also, they're seeing somebody lying. Somebody's mask is about to start slipping off here, okay? Listen, let me just go ahead and say this. For whoever this is for, you guys, and remember, it's always puzzle pieces when you get a general read from me, you guys, whoever this is for, whoever this is, this dating, this hook up with, you know, collaboration, networking, rather is legal or le illegal. Listen, this right here is something to do. This right here is just because it's part of their toxicity. OK, that is all this is. This is a sex addiction. This is a drug addiction. This love you too, baby. This is an addiction to money. This is this is addictions. This is restrictions. This is bondage. This is temptation. OK, and they're easily swayed. All right. So listen. Yeah. Dude, female. It don't matter. It, it really just don't. Um, Listen, they, they out here part, partaking in this here. OK um all caked up and booed up and all this that and the third okay um but yeah something is definitely going to change i got that twice i got that three times here actually somebody is going to get some shocking news here now i don't know if the shocking news is going to be this pregnancy okay for some of you guys okay or somebody is just going to get some shocking news that somebody is about to leave somebody's ass because somebody is ready to close the cycle out and they're closed off guarded and resistant to whoever this person is and their behavior and their toxicity that they have brought okay they've already been feeling rejection for some of you that will be true they've already been feeling lost for some of you that will be true and for somebody it will be true that this already has been a whole bunch of pieces that somebody has to pick up feeling very fragmented okay but nonetheless this here shocking news whatever this here is 
it is going to come quick okay you guys and i'm do i do me quick i'm not a sword it's quick okay listen this is going to be very fast moving information that is going to come okay um and it's going to shock the hell out of somebody okay um this is for some of you this will be something that you'll find out that somebody did in the past okay a uh, recent past even okay um for some of you it will be now okay but regardless to when you what when this incident that you find out that is going to be very shocking listen it's going to cause some type of lack for some of you and it's going to cause some type of suffering for some of you that's the reason why somebody is ready to say goodbye and close this here cycle but the other individual because you know maybe this was a secret or whatever the case may be listen they don't want the cycle to close all right right yeah they're the, listen this toxicity that they have, this restrictions, temptations, bondage, manipulation, materialism, materialisticism, and addictions of all type of sorts, sex addictions, money addictions, you know, drug addictions, whatever addictions, okay? Listen, this is their fulfillment, okay? They like this. This is the type of behavior they like. They could also be addicted to being to the, in the street, y'all. That is going to be the truth for some of y'all as well, okay? So let's go ahead and get this thing rolling, okay? Aries, it's been a minute, you guys. Much love, my day ones, you guys. Thank you so much for still being here with me. I love you guys to death. Um, my uh, Train to Go member, shout out, TTG. You guys, join Train to Go. We clicked up, y'all. It is a lot of amazing, wonderful people on spiritual journeys, y'all. It's about being in the know. It's spiritual ascension. It's self-ascension. And it's also financial ascension with a community of people who are on different journeys, different, you know, hey, it's a lot of support there, okay? I'll get more to it at the end of the video. Um, you guys, um, for my new and recent subscribers, you guys, thank you so much for accepting my invitation to uh, subscribe. You guys, I am very happy that you are here. If you have not let me know that you're new to the channel, please go in the comment section below. Let me know that you're new. And in that way, I can give you a warm welcome that you deserve. Okay. Um, I, I do love to do that. All right. And, and I am glad that you're here for my VIPs. You guys, thank you so much for your support. I love you guys to death. You know that shout out to my VIPs Aries as usual, always I've already prayed over these here clarifiers in the name of the father, the son and the Holy spirit Aries. I've asked for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace and protection. As I give Jesus Christ, all the praise, the honor and the glory. Okay. This is what we expected in this read. Okay. So, and another thing too is, is that somebody here, um, you may be married to this person or propose or whatever, not right. But at the same time, you know, somebody could be really renewing their faith as well. Okay. They may be like really going into themselves. They may be doing a lot of meditation. They may be praying a lot, you know, going to church or, or, so, or even being a part of a religious organization. Okay. Even a high, high part of a religion. I mean, pastor, deacon, it could be that too. Okay. Um, but tell me about this detour, Holy Spirit, because honestly, this is, you know, somebody is definitely taking a detour here. Things ain't, you know, they, 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 they not on track. Okay. It's been some bullshit and somebody is like, they're changing courses. Okay. Right. They're going to go get their happiness. Pregnancy here is again here twice now. Okay. Somebody might be pregnant. You could be pregnant. Somebody you know could be pregnant or somebody could have got somebody pregnant here. But somebody wants their happiness. Okay. And I'm going to tell you another thing. Somebody wants their free, their, 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 um, their freedom. Okay. Because they've really been in suspension and limbo and uncertain, uh, you know, for too long. Okay. And somebody is ready to lose themselves from this here energy. Okay. Somebody wants some forward momentum. Somebody wants their happiness. They want to dig. They want to go in. So for some of you, it will be true. But they want to go inside their spirituality. For some of you, they just want peace. They they want to, to put their self back together again. Okay. They're, they want to get up out of this toxicness. They're ready for this good news. Okay. They want to be new beginning here. Somebody is doing self-improvement here and somebody is ready to surrender or sacrifice something. There is spiritual enlightenment here for some of you guys. Give me Wheel of Fortune, please, because this is toxicity. Somebody has learned a lot of lessons here. OK, but these was lessons that was supposed to be meant. You see what I'm saying? You're going to go forward if you do close this cycle out. You know, a lot of people say the cycle can be forced. It can be forced. OK, but you know what? To close the cycle out is also a choice. All right. We have a choice to close the cycle out as well. All right. So, yes, yeah, sometimes fate will bring that. Sometimes God will bring that. Um, but, you know, in this situation, for some of you, the truth is, is that there is there is a cycle that's closing and it, it is because of the Lord. OK, um, but for others of you, there's a cycle closing because you're making that judgment. All right. 
Right, because somebody is falling back, okay? There is somebody here that has experienced loneliness, anxiety, and grief. Definitely when the secret comes out or has. Um, but stress and fear, too. Somebody needs to recuperate, all right? Somebody needs some self-protection. They need to retreat. They need to get away from this situation, okay? Mentally, emotionally, and physically, you see what I'm saying? Because like I said, they've been hanging upside down for too long, y'all, with this here hangman, okay? They've been they've been um, in limbo. It's been stagnant. There's been lies, okay? There's been much um, toxicity here. And somebody definitely does need self-protection. Self They're going to have to retreat here in order to charge their batteries. Right, you see what I'm saying? Third party situation. Somebody may not be feeling well. So there's maybe an older person here that don't feel well. Nursing home, hospital, some type of um, facility like that. Um, but somebody is definitely in a third party situation that somebody is knowing about. Um, and like I said, it's going for some of you, it's going to be a workplace affair. OK, um, for some of you, it's going to be somebody in the streets that's fooling with somebody who, you know what I'm saying? They say they just a home girl. They say they just a homeboy or even somebody that somebody, you know, is doing illegal activity, selling things that they ain't got no business selling to somebody. And they're having sex with that person. OK, um, but nonetheless, we got institution here. We got, um, you know, like I said, nursing home. Somebody may be sick. You guys not feeling well at all. Um, the hospital is also here. Um, there is, um, possibly friends and family. Okay. That is maybe not giving too much good advice, giving wrong information to this person. This, maybe family members or friends are in this person's ear too. And then on top of that, um, somebody could work for the medical field here as well, or some type of institution. Um, but yeah, this, 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 this is, you know, Give me more Holy Spirit. Somebody needs to fall back from this because there's other people involved in this. It's like, you know what? It's all too much. It's all too much. Okay. It's just, you know, somebody's like, I need to retreat. I need for my dreams to come true. I need foresight on my stuff. I need to sit here and think about what I want to do. Okay. Somebody already told somebody to ass off. Okay. Somebody told somebody how they feel. They let somebody have it. Okay. They did not miss their words. That was very direct. Whoever this person is, is somebody, husband, wife, baby, mom, baby, dad. Okay. There may have been a gathering here as well for some of you guys not too long ago or coming up. Yeah, somebody's fine. It's gossiping. Go it's gossip going around this. Okay. You know, some of these people is not putting no respect on somebody's name here as well. Okay. So it could be a situation to where as somebody did not only just tell their person off. It could have been a situation to where somebody told somebody's family member or friend off. Okay. Because like I said, somebody don't have respect for somebody here. They're not, they're, you know, right. And what somebody knows, okay, and with the gossip, like I told you, is this here indulging, okay? This here indulging in mental, multiple um, possibilities, multiple options, okay? So if this is a female, there's multiple dudes that she has options with. If this is a dude, he got multiple females that he got options with or whatever the situation is, Okay. And this shit right here is toxic. And somebody is like, I'm tired of hanging upside down. Like, you got me twisted. Like, I got stuff to do. I'm three of wands. I want to go into my dreams, okay? I want my success. I want my entrepreneurship. I want my hard work to pay off. You see what I'm saying? I need, I need to fall back because I need to gain some vision. Because I need to see where I'm going with this thing, okay? To set my goals, okay? And you just doing, sitting out here doing all this toxic stuff, acting like you going to work and shit and flirting and carrying on. All out here like you in these streets getting money and carrying on. You got me messed up. That's what somebody's saying. Listen, they do not want to let this go. All right. It's just that simple. I told you once either this is a fake thing. OK. And the cycle is changing or somebody is calling a shot and this is changing. OK. Listen, somebody is they don't want this to end. OK. They are very um, happy, okay, being able to live this toxic lifestyle and have somebody here on deck still, okay? They are very happy with the things, the, you know, the way things is going, okay? Like, you know, they don't know nothing about you not being happy, all right? And if they do know something about you not being happy, listen, they don't give a fuck, all right? They want things to stay the same, all right? You keep doing you, and they're going to keep doing them, and we're going to keep doing this thing. That's how they feel, okay? But somebody's like, no, 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 okay? No, 
First of all, I'm fixing to get my faith on 10. That's number one. Then for that's going to be true for some of you. Then another thing too is I'm about to get real certain and real clear on what I need to sacrifice and surrender so that I can have me some forward momentum to walk into my dreams. Okay. And another thing too is, is I want my happiness. And another thing is I want my peace and I want my serenity. And I'm very optimistic about leaving you alone and closing this cycle. Somebody saying that. Somebody feels that way. Okay. Somebody done, and then for on a side note, for the ones that the faith is on 10, I got a very religious individual here, okay, that have fell off the wagon, all right? They are now renewing that, okay? They are now coming back around to God, okay? That's that's a side note. Yeah, it done already went down. We got travel. We got relocation. Listen, I don't see the tower yet. It may show up, but I see the six swords, okay? So it done already went down. Like I said, somebody want their peace, Okay. They want to move into calmer waters. Listen, we got drugs. We got alcohol. Somebody possibly is um, in rehab um, or need to be one or the other. OK, um, maybe they, you know, in jail, some type of government facility, like I said before, you guys. Um, but definitely is in a recovery process or needs to be in a recovery process. Nonetheless, somebody definitely does want stability. There's travel where there's relocation here. Somebody not may not be where um, somebody is, you know. You know, somebody may be from a different background or they're not from whatever state or, you know, whatever part of town, you know, that they are now. Tell me about the toxicity, please, Holy Spirit. Yeah, they worship a lot of stuff, y'all. They worship money. OK, they worship sex. All right. Drugs, alcohol, street life. OK, they worship all that. OK, and they're serious. All right. They're serious about it. They go after it. They'll go get it when it comes down to those things. Okay. Because they're always looking for other different prospects. They're always looking for different opportunities. But I why? Somebody a little bit younger here. Give me more. Somebody a little bit younger than somebody else. There's going to be true, true for some of you. For your sons and your daughters, Holy Spirit, please. Right. See, they like. Listen, y'all, this is a very toxic individual. This, like I said, puzzle pieces, y'all. Anytime y'all get a general read from me, it is always puzzle pieces. But let me just tell you something about this toxic person right here, okay? Listen, the one that's drug addicted, the one that's sex addicted, the one that worship money, that one, the one that got an alcohol problem, um, the one that's sick for some of y'all. Um, this they get off, okay, on um causing anxiety, okay. Now, I say they get off on it. They may not necessarily get off on it for some of you guys, but the things that they do is okay. Remember I told you that they don't give a fuck, okay? I mean that, all right? They know that it's causing anxiety. They know that what they're doing is causing fear. They know that what they're doing is causing somebody to feel powerless and helpless, okay? They know that somebody's victimized. Somebody might have jumped on somebody here. Domestic violence might be here, okay? Somebody may be in prison. Somebody um, may be going to jail, okay? I do got government facilities, all right? They want somebody blinded to the truth, okay? It really just is that simple. Somebody trying to lose themselves from this energy. Yeah, they dating. Yeah, they taking somebody out, okay? Ain't thinking about it at all. Ain't analyzing nothing. Yeah, they just, all they care about is their happiness, their wishes granted, their fulfillment, okay? That's it. They don't care nothing about, you know, they're not thinking. When the hermit is upside down, y'all, they're not thinking. They're not analyzing. They're not saying, oh, you know, let, let's just say I got a baby mom, okay? And she at home with my child. They're not thinking if I go out here and I deal with somebody, oh, I'm going to lose my whole family. No, they're not thinking about that, okay? They're just doing it. It's impulsiveness, all right? Because that's what they want to do. Because it's wishes granted. And it's the reason why somebody's about to say goodbye. They're very closed off and resistance to this change that's fixing to take place. Some of them ain't going to have no choice, all right? Pregnancy is here again three times now, okay? They're going to be trying to romance. They're going to be trying to come back around. Once they feel like somebody is closed off or and resistant and guarded, they're going to be wanting to come back around. They're going to want to give to the situation. You may get gifts, you know, more, more love, more attention, you know, something like that. Okay. Because they don't want this cycle to end. They don't want somebody to walk away here. It's been too long. They're too used to this. Okay. They're too used to, to behaving in the way they behave in this relationship. 
They done took somebody for granted, okay, is what they done did. Give me Ace of Wands. They're going to try to control this new beginning. Somebody is, but it's not going to work, okay, because I got somebody showing up as Nine of Pentacles, okay? Somebody wants to get self-reliant if they're not already, okay? Somebody wants their thriving success. Somebody wants their achievement, okay? They're, they're elegant, rather it's a dude or a female, okay? Or they got swag, rather it's a dude or a female, okay? Um, nonetheless, their material security is first and foremost. I told you they threw a wand, okay? Listen, they don't, they've all, if, if you could be in different cycles, okay? Puzzle pieces. If you're at the point to where is your, you, you, you upside down, right? Hey man, nothing shaking, okay? Somebody is thinking about their three of wands. They're moving forward. They're forward momentum, okay? How they can close this cycle out, okay? Or praying for it, all right? Now, if you already have got the spiritual enlightenment, you've already loosened yourself and you're already going towards this here sun, okay? Um, then yes, somebody will be feeling this energy as far as somebody feeling like somebody's being left behind, all right? And they're going to start getting desperate here, okay? They don't want the cycle to close. They're closed off. They're resisting it, okay? They're saying, no, you belong to me. And this is what we've been doing, okay? And so this is what we're going to continue doing, okay? Now, for some of you that have already got out of that cycle, and it's like, I'm already deuces. I'm already out, okay? With this here six of swords, I'm already leaving the past along. Listen, somebody is going to be trying to show you another side of them, okay? They're going to be like, you know, giving things, trying to give gifts, be nice, um, loving, um, you know, and all this. All right. They're going to come across like they're persistent. They're going to come across like they're um, ambitious about this here relationship, even though we already had a whole bunch of bullshit going on and somebody already found us. I'm out. OK, so listen, I don't know which one you are. Puzzle pieces. Cross watcher energy can and will get involved in this cross watcher. I want you guys to know that I love Cross Watchers just like I love Aries. This is Aries that's done this to you. Please go in the comment section below. Let me know. I am very interested how energy interchanges. You guys will be helping me out an awful lot. I love you, Cross Watcher. And you guys, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button for me, please. Appreciate you guys. Yeah, somebody showing up um, single in the button. Damn right. With the Ace of Wands. With new beginning. Okay? Money. Luck. Forward momentum. Yeah. Nine of uh, five pinnacles upside down. Somebody said no more scandals. No more disgrace, okay? No more um, gossiping. No more talking. No more not putting respect on my name, okay? No more taking L's with you. I'm not willing to do that, all right? Whatever information is going to be coming quick, okay? Something is fast-moving energy, you guys. Possibly has something to do with a Virgo towards Capricorn. Possibly. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, or Leo. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, or Leo. Possibly, okay? Libra, Gemini, Aquarius is also here. What is he doing, Holy Spirit, please? <laughs> you about to be finding out about this star party. About to be finding about how they've been romancing. How they've been admiring folks, okay? And some of y'all about to find out about how this person pregnant. Some of y'all about to find out an awful lot of information about this here, um... You know, a little, little relationship, this admiration and carrying on that somebody got. This person is borderline obsessive. Listen, they've been texting the hell out of this other individual. Y'all, they've been calling this other individual. They've been texting this other individual. It's almost like they giving this other individual um, more attention, you know, even if they are in a marriage or a higher connection. This is definitely taking a risk. They know this, but I told you they didn't care. Because they don't. Somebody about to lose. Somebody about to lose their family. Somebody about to lose their love. Somebody that's been down with them. Told you this is a workplace affair. Got something to do with somebody dealing with somebody that they know, that they collaborate with, network with, possibly in the same field. Yeah, this has already been a fucking burden. Somebody done already cried, cried a damn river. Somebody already tried to make this work. And tried to mend it and everything, okay? Listen, this is the tower right here. It done already went down for some of you guys, okay? Or will be. Yeah, there's a lot, Aries. Or Cross Watcher. So, you guys, you guys know how this goes, okay? This is for my new and recent subscribers, you guys. These are letters that I pull. 
um, this may uh, resonate to this read, okay? You can, if you want to, put your situation down there. And I will randomly pull um, if this does resonate. Um, this right here is my train to go perk, you guys, okay? So as I mentioned to you guys in the beginning of the video, join train to go. It is about being in the know. Um, it is a lot of perks there. It's spiritual ascension, self-ascension, and also financial ascension, okay? A lot of beautiful people there. We all on different different stages in our journey, um, but very supportive. You will see them down there in the comments with badges, you guys, um, mingling with you guys, um, talking. This is a family, y'all. It's just really just that simple, okay? It's a soul family, all right? And train to go, we are clicked up, okay? So we do got each other, and honestly, they got direct contacts in me. And, um, you know, like I said, whatever tier is three of them. OK, um, all you got to do is a join. Um, you can get a free read on one of the tiers, two free questions a week on one of the tiers um, and also one one on one, one one on one with me a month. OK, and everything to do with spirituality. OK, or if you're going through whatever you're going through, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, but there is excellent community. OK. Um, so join train to go. But anyway, you guys also, if you guys are going through any type of love problems, love relationship, heartbreak, toxic love, having a hard time letting love go, please go ahead and check my uh, website out. HRHNikkiTarot.com. HRHNikkiTarot.com. There I've written several articles regarding, um, and I got this L that want to come out y'all. Um, but regarding, um, those topics I just mentioned, okay? For every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. My mystery grabs are fun. They're very random. And also, my um, monthly winners. I celebrate my subscribers. I celebrate my Train to Go members, okay? So, um, you guys subscribe. Let me go ahead and get you guys some, um, some time frames here. Yeah, they're resistant to this cycle closing. They really just are. They're not... You know, they're not with this, okay? They're like, you've been doing this, we've been doing this, and things just need to stay this way, okay? For some of you, this is going to be a long relationship. A very long one, okay? And for some of you, this is not going to be a very long relationship. Remember puzzle pieces anytime you get a general read from me. Okay. So listen, we got the month of March, which is this month. Okay. We got um, May. We got November. We got November. And we got summer and winter time. Okay. So that may resonate for some of you guys. Winter, summer, November, May. Oh, we got air element too, you guys. So let me explain that. And we got March, okay? So air, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay? That in Thanksgiving is at the top of the deck, okay? So listen, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay? Somebody, first of all, it represents somebody being in their head right now, okay? It does definitely represent somebody letting somebody ass have it. Um, somebody is really in their thoughts. They're thinking of what they're going to do. I feel like they're thinking about this relationship, closing the cycle out and going, starting their own, loosen themselves from this. Also maybe thinking about the Lord here and also, uh, possibly maybe thinking about the information that they found out so that, you know, that's air. Okay. Um, also it could be Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay. Heavy in somebody's chart. I know that you're not, um, an air sign Aries. I'm very well aware of that. Um, but that doesn't mean that you don't have it in your chart, okay? So, in the third-party chart, your person chart, or, you know, whoever, okay, that could be involved in this. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, somewhere in the natal chart. It could be Ascendant, Sun, Descendant, Mercury, Venus, Mars, somewhere in the uh, natal chart, okay? So, this letter L wanted to come out, okay? We got two letter R's. We got letter N. We got letter J. We got letter E. We got letter T. We got letter Y, we got letter B, we got letter F, we got letter K, we got letter U, we got letter P, and we got letter D, okay? So, let me repeat these and let you guys know who is on the table, and then we will uh, close out, okay? Letter D, letter P, letter U, letter K, letter F, letter B, letter Y, T, E, J, letter N, and two R's, and like I said, this L wanted to come out, okay? So that may be significant. Could be initials, whatever, you know? All right, so 
Yeah, somebody about to find out something about somebody, the little third party here. We got Virgo towards Capricorn. Somebody ain't taking no more L's. They're done with it, okay? It's just as simple. Whoever this reads for. Um, we got Virgo here. So, yeah, somebody needs to put some respect on somebody's name. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Institution of some type of sort. Sagittarius, Leo. Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio, Taurus. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Somebody wants somebody to be blinded to the truth, y'all. We got Aquarius. We got Taurus. Capricorn. Yeah, they've been dating them. Somebody pregnant. They may try to come back, okay? They may. But y'all already know what's up. All right, you guys. This is what I have for you. If I was able to put one piece together for you, that means I definitely done my job. I'd appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe, Aries. As always, much love. I'll see you guys soon.